Hi, it's Kerry. Today we are looking at some more interesting dragons, lizards and frogs. My favourite is still the Komodo dragon. Can you tell me what the more common name for a Pagona lizard is? Give a thumbs up if you like reptiles, dragons, lizards or frogs. This is the common coloured lizard. It is a North American lizard that can grow to 14 inches or 36 centimetres in length, including the tail. It has a large head and powerful jaws. They are well known for the ability to run on their hind legs, looking like small theropod dinosaurs. The name collared lizard comes from the lizard's distinct coloration, which includes bands of black around the neck and shoulders that look like a collar. This would be a male. The females have a light brown head and body. The frilled neck lizard. It lives in tropical parts of North Australia and South New Guinea. Most frilled neck lizards are a brown to reddish colour. They like to be active during the day and bask in the sun in the morning and early afternoon. The frilled neck lizard is an ambush predator and waits patiently, then surprise attacks its victims. Its diet consists of ants, cicadas, spiders, small lizards, termites and small mammals. The frilled neck lizard belongs to the group of arboreal animals. It spends most of its time on the trees. When it is faced with danger, the frilled neck lizard elevates its forelegs to appear bigger, unfolds and extends its frill, opens its yellow mouth and starts to hiss. I'd be running. <laughs> this is the Pagona lizard, also known as the bearded dragon. The bearded dragon lives amongst the bushes and trees and can also be found basking on rocks. They are popular pets in the US. The bearded dragon is an omnivore and likes to eat insects, small rodents, lizards and leafy plants. The bearded dragon has a specific way to greet other members of the group or to show submission in front of a more dominant male. It will stand on three legs while rotating the remaining leg in the air. Totally amazing. The thorny dragon, also known as a thorny devil. It is unique with there being no other lizard like the thorny devil anywhere in the world. The thorny devil is a small lizard with the average adult thorny devil only growing 20 centimetres in length and weighing about the same as the average mouse. The thorny devil is best known for having an extremely spiky looking appearance and the thorny devil can blend well into the vast Australian desert due to the colour of the thorny devil's skin. The body has a very rigid structure which aids the thorny devil in collecting water. Amazingly, in between the cone shaped spikes of the thorny devil, little channels form along the body which enables it to collect water from any part of its body which is transported to the mouse. The thorny devil mainly feeds on ants and collects the much needed moisture at night time, generally from morning dew drops. The thorny devil can eat some thousands of ants every day, which is remarkable for such a small creature. The Komodo Dragon. Komodo dragons are the largest lizards and a member of the monitor lizard family. They can reach 10 feet or 3 meters in length and weigh more than 300 pounds which is 136 kilograms. Komodo dragons are the heaviest lizards on earth. Dragon saliva teems with over 50 strains of bacteria. When prey is bitten but escapes, within 24 hours the stricken creature usually dies of blood poisoning. Dragons calmly follow an escapee as the bacteria takes effect, using their keen sense of smell to hone in on the corpse. A dragon can eat a whopping 80% of its body weight in a single feeding. Notice the forked tongue there, much like a snake. Adult Komodo dragons are cannibals, which means they can eat their own species, and 10% of their diet is made of newly hatched Komodo dragons. These young dragons take straight to the trees once they're born for safety. The African reed frog. 
Many of the 211 species are beautifully coloured and patterned and are between 1 to 3 inches in length. Most of the species in this family live in trees, although some live on the ground. The frogs in this family have sticky toe pads and extra cartilage between the last two bones of each toe to make their toes more flexible. Chameleons are amazing lizards. Special colour pigment cells under the skin allow some species to change their skin colour, most often for camouflage. I really like the chameleon's amazing eyes. The bulging upper and lower eyelids are joined and the pupil peeks out from a pinhole sized gap. Their eyes can rotate and focus separately on 180 degree arcs so they can see two different objects at the same time. This gives them a full 360 degree field of vision. Their eyesight is so good they can see small insects 5 to 10 meters away. The tongue can reach its prey in a split second. Chameleons usually eat large insects such as locusts, grasshoppers, crickets and stick insects. Tuatara is a lizard-like reptile found only on the 32 islands surrounding New Zealand. They can reach 24 inches or 60 centimetres in length. Males are larger than females. Tuatara is a greenish brown or grey coloured depending on their habitat. They have a crest made of triangular folds of skin on the dorsal side of the body. The crest is especially prominent in males which use it to attract females during the breeding season and to intimidate competitors. Tuatara's are carnivores. They eat things like beetles, crickets, spiders, frogs, lizards, eggs and birds. They like to bask in the sun during the day to increase their body temperature. The green frog. Although frogs live on land, their habitat must be near swamps, ponds or in a damp place. This is because they will die if their skin dries out. Instead of drinking water, frogs soak it into their body through their skin. Frogs can see forwards, sideways and upwards all at the same time. Thank you for watching my video. Please stay right on here at Super Fun Reviews for more amazing videos. See you again soon. Remember to tell me what the more common name for the Begonia lizard is. For more dinosaur videos, click the picture.